Welcome back to Local 10. We have to talk about what happened in Broward County last night. At least two tornadoes were reported. You see here some of the damage that we have seen. This is in Davie. Mobile homes ripped apart. Local 10 Syrah on work. Continue our team coverage this morning from Davie. Syrah. And that is where we are right now. The Sunshine Village mobile home that was just rocked by this weather event the residents believe was a tornado. Take a look at this house here. You can see the insulation. They boarded some of it up since this morning, but they say this happened just before 2 a.m. You can just see all of these home parts scattered all over the lawn, and this is not the only damaged home. We're seeing this all up and down the street. So let's take you to video now so you can get a closer look at some of this damage. I can tell you every resident we've spoken to this morning in this mobile home park lost power. They've reached out to FPL. They're hoping to get their power restored soon. They say they were shocked that this weather event came through here because they were prepared for a tropical storm. They say they were happy that we weren't going to get hit, uh, get a direct hit from Hurricane Ian. But then this came through and they were just completely caught off guard. I did speak to one resident. He said his kids got an alert on their phones 30 seconds before what appeared to be a tornado hit their mobile home park. His name's Ivan Mendoza telling us about waking up to his kids getting that warning on their phone. Not even 20 seconds later, we were feeling it already inside the house. So um, it was no time only to react. It was just everybody getting together and that's it. So again, this is just one of the homes. This is actually Ivan Mendoza's home that again was rocked by this uh, again, what appears to have been a tornado around 2 a.m. We're going to talk to some more people that live here, uh, see what the power situation is. Uh, so far, uh, it doesn't seem that anyone was injured, but we're hoping to get some official confirmation on that. But that is the very latest live here in Davie, Syrah Onwar, Local 10 News.